What's up YouTube? In this video I'm going to show you how to kill Commander Zalk and get a nice powerful weapon to start the game off with. First thing you want to do is kill off all the normal enemies as quickly and efficiently as you can. Now you're going to be relying on your Mind Flayer ally to deal most of the damage to Zalk. You might even stun him. If he stuns him you'll have a 100% chance to hit so try to hit him with the strongest ranged attack you can which at this point is probably Shadow Heart's Guiding Bolt. I only realized this in hindsight, so I hit him with Sacred Flame instead like a total idiot. But I killed him anyway, so it didn't matter. Keep moving your party towards the ship's console while attacking Zalk. You're going to miss a lot, but every little bit of damage counts. Once you move within a certain distance of the console, some enemy reinforcements will appear. They're weak, so dispatch them quickly so you can resume focusing your attacks on Zalk. When there are 9 turns remaining until the ship crashes, some more powerful enemy reinforcements will arrive, but they will take a few turns to reach you, so I wouldn't worry about them. Keep on attacking Zalk at every chance you get, and with the help of your Mind Flayer ally, he should die with plenty of time for you to get to the console and escape the ship. Beware that the Mind Flayer will turn on you once Zalk is dead. Make sure you loot Zalk's corpse for a nice powerful greatsword to use early in the game. Give it to Lazel so she can boof enemies like this. No oh my goodness. Hey buddy. <laughs> Perfect. Well, that's it for this video. See you later.